Yo, what's up everybody? Today I'm just going to be doing a little simple tutorial on how to import your Xbox Game Pass uh, or whatever save file you use for Xbox to uh, Steam. For this example, I'm going to be using Hollow Knight. And so yeah, let's just get into it. So first of all, if you already have the, um, the game on your computer, uh, if not, you can download the Xbox app and download it from there. But you want to go to your files, go to this PC, local disk and then you want to go to your users select whatever user is yours and then go to app data you want to go to local not local low um, and you want to search up packages um, if you just use the search bar it's really easy and then once you go to packages right there then you want to search for team cherry once you find team cherry you want to go to system app data Go to WGS, and now you want to see which file is bigger and pick that file. So that file is 307 kilobytes, which is the one I want to use. So I double click that one. Now you're going to do the same thing. So you want to find whichever file is bigger than the rest. Uh, for this one, for example, double click on that. And then the file you find in there is your save file. So you're going to want to copy that save file. Go back to your local disk. Same place. Go to app data from users. Once you get to app data, you're going to go to local low this time, look for Team Cherry, Hollow Knight, and then what you're going to do now is you're going to paste your save file into there. So now what you want to do is you want to rename it to user1.dat. That tells Steam that this is a save file, so it'll change it to a dat file. And now if you load up Hollow Knight, like I'm doing right now, it should give you the same file that was from your Xbox. So now if I load it up, if you press start game, then there's your save file right there. Um, you can import other save files from your Xbox if you want to. Same thing, just name it user2.dat, user3.dat, etc. Um, it might be a little more difficult to find those files because you're looking for whichever file is the second biggest or third biggest, but uh, that's all. Thank you for watching.